another frustrating afternoon, uh, another defeat. Is this one harder to take given the fact that second half performance was, was so battling and so spirited? Yeah, we were better uh, second half, but I mean, we've got to be better. We've got 11 players first half. I think we started slow. Um, to be honest, at the moment, I think it's a confidence issue across the whole team. Um, we've just got to turn it around. Obviously, the manager said we've we battled well second half and maybe deserves a point in the end just for how well we've done with 10 men against a good side. I keep the ball really well, but we've got to do a better first half and we've got 11. You mentioned the word confidence there. Do you think that's the main difference from the start of the season when we were, we were playing with freedom, we were scoring goals and the recent run of form? Is it just a confidence thing, do you think? Yeah, anyone that's played football knows that confidence is such a massive part of the game and if you're struggling for it, you maybe don't want the ball as much as you should or you don't feel as comfortable getting on the ball and then that kind of goes throughout the team. Um, obviously, at the start of the season, we were scoring freely and you know, me and Rob were getting a lot of joy. Um, it was brilliant and you know it was great to watch and we were full of confidence the fans were enjoying it we were having we were buoyant we loved it um but we're going through a sticky spell and we just need to keep working hard it's cliche but we work hard do the right things on the training ground and got to turn it around and i've spoke to, to tommy and i spoke to a few people but the rubs of the red cards a big turning point for for joe what's his view on it from from inside the change room and what, what did you have a good view of it as well because your header which which was in the build-up yeah, I didn't say it. I should probably score the header, to be fair, but I've just tried to head it down and the keeper's made a good save. Um, Joe's just said he's kind of trying to get to the, the ball um, and he's kind of in mid-air and he gets a bit of a knock and he's got nowhere to land apart from on the keeper. So, obviously, we'll just look back at it, but um, just got to believe, you know, got to believe Joe. And I, d I don't think he's silly enough to put his, us in that position and himself. So, it is a turning point in the game. Um, but, I mean, we then got better because of that, but really we, we need to be better with 11, I've said. But can we take confidence from that second-half performance? Because I suppose we're clutching the straws a little bit, but given recent performances, it's definitely something to go forward to next week against Trolley. Yeah, we've just got to keep working hard on the pitch and, you know, things will things will turn. And we've shown there, like, a bit of spirit for for each other and, uh, like, a will to, to fight for each other. And, in these times when we've been in them before, when you're not when they're not getting the rub of the green or you're not picking up results, it's all about just sticking with each other and being tight knit and working hard for each other. Um, and just we'll get that win and that'll be the confidence we need to then move on to the next one. And you win one or two and then you get back on a run and obviously at the moment we're on a bad run, but we've just got to look forward to Charlie and then Gloucester after that.